Hi guys, it's Ben uh, from Naga. Yeah, guys, uh, thanks for all the support again uh, for um, contributing into the Naga ICO. 63,000 people have invested uh, over $50 million raised. So it was a uh, full ex uh, success. And we are hap very happy um, that we are now in the moment of uh, distribution uh, of your tokens so you can uh, trade them and uh, use them in, uh, for the future. And uh, I really wanted to use this uh, uh, five minutes for a tutorial to show you basically how you uh, can receive the tokens because the flow um, is, is very important. So uh, we have the tokens now stored in our wallets. You bought them uh, with cryptos or credit cards or bank transfers. And if you want to, for example, use them on an exchange or send them to other recipients, um, we will need to have an address from you. And um, the Naga token is an ERC20 token. That means there are some wallets who are able to display this token, this ERC20 token. And thus, we will need to have um, uh, the security that you have an address and a wallet combination that uh, can display this. So I really want to make this quick. Uh, and uh, there are two ways. Number one is my Ether wallet, which we highly recommend, um, or MetaMask. It's easier to use, and uh, I will set this up uh, for you guys. So now I'm here in my uh, Naga ICO token balance. So everybody who bought tokens will see the balance here. And uh, here it says provide an address uh, you want to receive your NGCs to. So we need to first, if you don't have an address, generate an address, right? So let's go to myetherwallet.com. It's very easy, new wallet. Um, enter a, a password of your own choice. Uh, create a wallet. Very important to uh, save this key store file. It might sound very technical, but it's just like, like a key that you will need and that you need to open later. So let's just download it. Yep. Um, then it says, don't lose it, don't share it and make a backup. So keep it safe because this is the only way together with your password to access the wallet if, for example, the, this computer gets lost or stolen or you change it. So just keep that. The same about your private key. You can uh, print a paper wallet and uh, print this private key. Um, as, as I do it here, you just uh, basically uh, save it and uh, that's it, right? So um, I just had it once, so um, that's it basically. And then we save our address. Now, in order to see the address from my Ether wallet, so the address that we need uh, to give in here, um, we choose key store file, the stuff that I just download, right? The file. So I select the file um, and then I choose basically the latest file that I had here. And um, good. So now I enter a password and I'm unlocking my wallet. That's basically it. So and see here, now I have an address. Uh, and uh, this address is basically the one that I need uh, to be entered here. That's it, right? So I just save it. And um, after saving, page gets reloaded. And then it will ask you basically to, um, to confirm the address later on. Yeah. So um, it's very important that you basically check the balance and the uh, address that you've entered to... Um, to verify that this address is right, this uh, token balance is right, because our service will use this address to deliver you the token. So make sure it is exactly the right one. Do not use an address from an exchange, not from Coinbase or, or Kraken or HitBTC or all the other guys. Do not use an Ethereum address because those addresses eventually change in your account and then nobody can restore your tokens and you usually on exchanges do not have a key store file and the private key so uh, you cannot uh, really restore it let's uh, also uh, quickly set up with metamask so metamask is uh, for me i like it uh, a lot because it's easy to use but you need to have a chrome browser so get a chrome extension and uh, it will install it basically in your uh, browser so i'm just adding my browser now and um, adding this extension to my browser. And there will be a small a little um, fox now here, as you can see, yeah? So uh, what I'll do now, I just click on this little fox and uh, I'm accepting the terms. Then 
I'll be displayed also um, to enter my password. I'm creating now my MetaMask wallet or vault. Uh, you have to copy this. This is basically also your private key or like your secret phrase to encrypt the, uh, the private key later. So uh, I say I've copied it somewhere. Just copy it. And now I have an account as well. So this is my wallet, uh, which also is an ERC20 wallet. Okay. And uh, this, this ERC20 wallet, uh, uh, compatible wallet, will also be able to display the Naga. Uh, token balance because it's an ERC20 token. If you want to get the address, just click on those uh, three buttons. Say copy address to clipboard. So I copy it and I can just paste it 0x13 like uh, or I go um, to uh, see my account on Etherscan. Etherscan is a block explorer. You will see all the transactions when we send the tokens, when you send tokens, receive the tokens here and you also have this address so this address has to be entered the same way as my etherword. So you can choose either my Ether wallet or MetaMask, yeah, um, and then you you'll enter it here. Once that's entered, um, you need to confirm. That's very very important. So when we confirm it here, um, then um, I'll get a notification here, and it says address is confirmed and the uh, distribution is pending. So that means that our service received your address and then will distribute the tokens to this address. You'll get an email once the distribution is completed. Very important. Now let's assume you have your tokens uh, in, in, uh, um, received. So we sent you an email and you want to see how many tokens arrived at your wallet. So it should be exactly the amount that you bought. Um, in my Ether wallet, for example, what you can say here, you need to just um, load the tokens yeah or add a custom token okay if you load tokens you can see how many uh, of um, of the tokens you have uh, and uh, what balance it is now at the moment uh, naga uh, ngc is not in the list it will be it was validated but if if it's not here if you cannot find it here basically yeah uh, under n then what you'll do is you go up and um, one second here, and he will add a custom token. Yeah, custom token needs a contract address, a token symbol, and decimals. So you go back in uh, in this box here, and it says token at ad contract address, decimals, and token symbol. So I'm copying this to my clipboard. I'm going back to my Ether wallet. I'm entering this. I say token symbol NGC. I say decimals 18 and I'm just saving it. Once it's saved, it's reloading the token uh, tokens that I have on this wallet and will show me basically now NGC. So this is my balance at the moment. I have zero. So when, when I get the tokens, you will see them here. And what you can do uh, then as well, you can just tap on send uh, Ether and tokens and then you just again, just select your, your key store file and um, unlock it and then you can send whatever you have so when you have tokens it will basically uh, give you the uh, tokens that you're able to send see ngc you set a gas limit and then you send it so you can now send it to an exchange it's very straightforward um, if i use metamask however uh, this is also uh, my favorite i mean um, it's, it's just easier to use. You don't have to reload all the, all the key stuff file, etc. You just copy this token contract address once again. You go to your MetaMask uh, account and then you go to tokens. You say add token. You just provide this address and it, re it loads automatically from the Ethereum blockchain. Uh, the NGC, the decimals, add, that's it. My NGCs are visible. So this is the basic step. First of all, you have two options. Either my Ether wallet, create an account, and then uh, save your key store file, save your private key, um, and then select key store and JSON file to open uh, it. Uh, set your, uh, enter your password once again, and then you'll see your address. Enter this address here, save it, make sure it's right, confirm it. That's it. Once confirmed, 
the tokens will be distributed um, in some hours or right away. It depends on the service speed, but it should be pretty pretty fast. But bear in mind, 63,000 people were there, so some some uh, distribution is happening there. Or you uh, download MetaMask um, at this extension, right? Then um, go to your little fox, agree to everything, and then you can just simply copy um, the addresses to the clipboard or view the account on Etherscan. If you want to add a token, use the exact token contract address that we displayed in MetaMask. And in my Ether wallet, uh, you can do it here with adding a custom token. So I hope it helps. You can jump around the video a bit so you can just um, see the important bits and pieces. I highly recommend my Ether wallet or MetaMask. Do not use an Ethereum address from an exchange. Very, very important. And make sure that you follow the steps that we said because we cannot be made accountable if you enter a wrong address or a faulty address. So please make sure it's right. And then uh, contact our support on Telegram if something is uh, fishy or missing. Thank you.